Hey guys, it's Mac, and um, I just wanted to do a quick, um, not really a nutrition talk, but more of just a um, kind of, I get a lot of questions about, um, you know, what do you eat every day? Like, what's a typical day of eating for you? So I thought I'd give you like two sample days um, of what I eat. So um, typically for breakfast, um, I'll have like a, I, like a butternut squash, onion, three egg scramble. And for lunch, I'll have um, maybe some spinach sautéed with onions um, with some curry powder and, and coconut milk in there. So kind of some, like a creamy Indian curry. Um, and I may throw some, you know, leftover roasted chicken in um, with that. I roast a chicken, um, two chickens a week, one on Monday and one usually on Wednesday, uh, Thursday rather. So I've always got um, kind of chicken on hand to just throw in whatever I decide needs it or uh, whenever I want to eat it so um, and then for a snack I usually eat almonds because I think they're delicious and um, raw organic almonds and then for dinner I'll have something like I don't know spaghetti like chicken spaghetti squash um, with like olive oil garlic and a little bit of um, Italian seasoning and pepper on it so that's kind of the average day um, and then the next day I might have uh, two fried eggs over uh, some, you know, bed of raw spinach for breakfast. Um, for lunch, I might have, um, I mean, who knows, spaghetti squash again. Um, yeah, I ate a lot of spaghetti squash. <laughs> spaghetti squash again, and then for uh, snack, I'm probably more almonds. Um, if I'm feeling adventurous and, like, I want to spend more money, I'll buy pecans because I'm from Texas and pecans are amazing. Um, and for dinner, I'll have, you know, a spinach salad with some avocado and roasted red pepper and onion. And um, I just dress it with olive oil and lime juice. So um, it doesn't sound like a lot of food, but I guess if you saw the way it was prepared, um, I, I'm a big, big fan of healthy fats. So I eat a lot of coconut oil, a lot of coconut milk, a lot of olive oil and a lot of nuts so that's how I stay full throughout the day because fat keeps you full and um, contrary to popular belief fat actually doesn't make you fat the wrong kind of fat makes you fat um, because it makes you inflamed but we'll go into that um, in a different video blog I just wanted to give you guys kind of the quick and dirty on what you know eating uh, nothing out of a box or a bag and no grain or dairy or soy or beans is like um, and that's really pretty much it. Um, I do make sure that I eat every time I'm hungry. Yep. Eat when you're hungry. Stop when you're full. It's real simple. Um, pretty frequently I'll have, you know, like three bites left on my plate and I'll put it in a bowl and put it back in the fridge. So, um, and then sometimes I eat four or five times a day. Um, I'm just ravenous. So, your body will tell you when it needs fuel and it will tell you when it doesn't need fuel. So you just, um, if you or I or all of us really, um, can just listen to our stomach instead of our mouths, um, it'll make that easier. And also when you eat the right food, when you're not eating food that's oversaturated with, with fake flavoring and salt and all that kind of stuff, um, you'll find that you just won't need as much of it. Um, and you won't crave it like you do all that really processed sugary salty stuff so um, that's all I have for today um, like I posted the workout for today is really short um, it's just kind of an active rest day because um, after the last five days of working out I am scorched and my muscles need a break so um, I'm just gonna do um, one minute wall sit alternating with one minute plank I'm gonna do probably four rounds of that and then a couple hundred jumping jacks just to get my heart rate up um, yeah so that's really all I have um, today's workout is super short if you even want to do a workout or you can just do some stretching or you know whatever if your muscles are feeling tight take the time out to uh, to get a good stretch anyway I hope you guys have an awesome Thursday and I'll talk to you soon bye